Well, hello and good morning. This is the last Mini Beano of 2017. As you can tell, it's the middle of the night. It's actually the Saturday the 30th of December 2017, just gone five past four in the morning. Greenwich Mean Time, it's supposed to be raining. There's the odd spot in the air, but there's not a lot really. It's quite blowy. And I'm off to Hereford. So you can guess where I'm going. A uh, little bit of trepidation. I don't think there's anything wrong in the car, but <laughs> I've had incidents. Anyway, I have a clutch this time, which is good news. Mild. And there's sounds breeze. I don't know why I did that. But there you go. Okay, let's get on with it. Cost of coffee first. And the ball of the lights. However, I need to be the mayor of the bull. Saving for the saving for the that's what orange juice does to you. Saving the cascales in spoons for tomorrow. This doesn't open until about I think about eleven. So a quick one in here. Carpet for Mr. Manny. And this is in a Brecken Brewing glass, which I've never seen before. It's not from Brecken Brewing, it's from Hardy's and Hansons, which is probably belongs to a brick drawer somewhere. Rock on Rudolph, 4.2% alcohol by volume. As Mr. Manning would say, a cold drink. Mm, I think it's seen slightly better days. Malty. Bitterish. Um, I was going to say standard English bitter, but it's a little bit too malty for that. So it's a session here. 4.2%. B plus. They be open, which I think is great news. And I'm going in. It's still blowy. It's mild, but uh, wind chill. And we're off. Look at that. So, um, purple rain. Elderberry Berliner Weisser, and it says sour. 3.3 percent, which I don't care about. Strength does not equal quality from day up. No rain, however, there's a chill wind. And that is, that is absolutely wonderful. I don't give that any minus. I really like that. Another winner. Again. Moving on to number two. Actually. Wrong way. and grounded pop hand fallacy. Oh, no. Pale ale, I can read 4.4% alcohol by volume. Not very well. And this is the result. Mmm. That's a rumor. Mm. I don't know. Funky? Nice though. Yeah, spicy. B plus in a bit. Flying dog, sea salted caramel brown, seven percent. Three point six percent pale ale. Do you see it? It's 
It's most powerful. Oh, well, actually, I wouldn't say I'm keen on it. A lot of caramel. Can't get a lot of salt. That's fine. But not fun. Be plus. Magic rock. Rapture. I don't know what red hop ale means apart from the fact it is reddish. Reddish brown. 4.6% alcohol by volume. Flowers flooring for Mr. Manny. Smells lovely and hoppy. That's almost a B plus plus. It's a B plus and a bit and a bit. B plus and a bit. Yeah. Yeah. Refreshing. Okay. Never pop up. Start again. Never pop out at lunchtime for food because everyone else is looking for food. However, sausage and butter and chips. This is Two Roads Brewing. Plum goes 4.5% out of the whole by volume. Penguins and flood risk as whale season 2018. Ah, yes. Mmm, smells sour. Mm. Oh, that's really nice. Tart, fruity, sour, slightly acidic. Plus, plus. And so, Flanders. This is Arabia at 8% alcohol by volume. A huge. Flemish. This is from the Dolly Brewers, the Mad Brewers. They're crazed. We're going to come back to it because look at the head. And I need the head to go down a bit first. Rocky Belgian. 